Good evening to our spring 2020 graduates and your families joining in this much deserved recognition. This occasion does not replace your formal in-person commencement ceremony, but this evening we are excited to celebrate the completion of your studies, especially in the throes of a health crisis that is challenging the entire world. But despite this challenge, you pursued your education with great determination and in the process challenged us to achieve a remarkable level of innovation in the delivery of instruction and services to you all online. You responded remarkably well to the drastic shift from in-person to remote learning. And as you did, some of you even contributed precious time and resources to aid the nation's response to COVID-19. Two of your fellow students, one an emergency responder and another a service member were deployed to New York City to aid in its fight against the pandemic. One other student fabricated using 3D printing guards for healthcare workers to stop the irritation around the ears from repeatedly wearing face masks. Now I am not surprised by your generosity. You have always demonstrated concern through your support of the food pantries, book scholarships, and other efforts to assist students in need. So tonight's event is more than a celebration of academic achievement. It is also an acknowledgement of your calmness, courage, and compassion. Attributes that will be abundantly useful in the days and weeks ahead. Thank you for honoring us through your achievements. You demonstrate the power and value of Cuyahoga Community College as personified by tonight's College Credit Plus graduates, individuals completing a college degree while attending high school. Among them is Amber Bennett, a 14-year-old honor graduate completing just the ninth grade. Amber will continue her studies this fall at Notre Dame College, where she will complete a bachelor's degree before finishing high school. Congratulations, Amber, on your noteworthy achievement. And congratulations to everyone. This is a defining moment in your life, spurred by a global crisis. Seize this moment to make your mark on the world, one community at a time. And congratulations again. And now to continue the celebratory remarks, it is my privilege to introduce the chairman of the Cuyahoga Community College Board of Trustees, Mr. Andrew Randall. Good evening, I'm Andrew Randall and have the privilege of serving as chair of the Board of Trustees at Cuyahoga Community College. And on behalf of the Board of Trustees, welcome you to the college's first virtual, virtual celebration of our graduates. We are meeting tonight to celebrate all of you, me at home, wearing my Triceratops gear, and you in a safe place. I speak for my eight fellow colleagues on the board when I say, we did not want to miss the opportunity to acknowledge and congratulate you on your great achievement. You have persevered through some very trying circumstances and you should be proud. Many possibilities await as you begin this new journey. You are well prepared to achieve your hopes and desires armed with the education you have acquired and in the degree you are receiving tonight. We know you can and will impact your family as well as our community. Please know you are capable of great things. Once again, on behalf of the Board of Trustees, I send congratulations and best wishes in all your future endeavors, and we look forward to the opportunity when we can greet you in person to extend great congratulations to them. Now it's my privilege to introduce our student speaker, Marissa Reed, president of the Western Campus Student Government. My name is Marissa Reed. I'm the current president of Western Campus Student Government, editor-in-chief of The Voice newspaper, and a member of Phi Theta Kappa Honor Society. Enough about me though. These remarks are not about myself, but rather about all of you, the class of 2020, to honor your achievements, your hard work, and your time here at Cuyahoga Community College. You have all made it this far, and that is something to be so proud of. 
I know this is not the way any of us predicted your time here at Tri-C would end. Life changed so fast, and just a few months ago, we were saying goodbye to leave for spring break, ready to relax after midterms week. However, none of us really knew the extent of those goodbyes. There were so many challenges faced after and all the difficult moments experienced. The period of transition from in-person classes to all online, from going out every day to only staying at home, from seeing our families here and there to being with them nonstop. Some of us suffered, some of us struggled, and some even failed. However, you, the graduates of the class of 2020, persevered through all of this. You endured the hardships and came back on the other side triumphant. And now, your time here ends, and we say yet another goodbye as this chapter of your lives at Tri-C ends and you begin new ones. Some of you will transfer to four-year universities, others will enter into the workforce full-time. Whichever path you are on, whether this degree or certificate took you two years or 20 years, I commend your diligence, dedication, and strength. You have achieved so much. This will definitely go down as one of the strangest and hardest years any of us will ever face. However, the comeback will be far greater than any setback. Your story is not finished, and this is not the end. Continue to make us all proud as Tri-C alumni. Once again, congratulations to all the graduates. And now I'd like you to hear from some of our graduates talking about what graduating means to them. Graduating from Tri-C feels like the end of one journey and the beginning of another. It's allowed my children to see that this is possible. I'm the first generation in my immediate family to attain a college degree. So getting my college degree means everything to me. And it's made all the difference for not just myself, but for generations to come. Being at this college has opened up so many doors for me and it has improved my skills for the IT industry. Tri-C has helped me to blossom into the professional businesswoman I am today. Tri-C means so much to me. It has been the best decision I've made to go back to school, and I now have something that nobody can ever take away from me, and that is my education. I'm so eager um, to get out into the community and start working in my prospective degree. Um, so thank you, Tri-C, for everything that you've given me and thank you to everyone that supported me along the way. Congratulations to everyone graduating this semester. Um, I know it was difficult, but we did it. Um, everyone stay safe, stay healthy, and I'll always be rocking my Tri-C merch. I'm 14 years old and I'm graduating from Cuyahoga Community College. I'll be graduating this May with my social arts degree and in December with my social science degree. It's been such a huge blessing to have the support of my family throughout my journey. And I am so happy for all the many blessings in my life. I just wanted to thank Tricy for being so impactful in my life, for being supportive and loving. And I know that's weird to say for a college, but they have been loving and caring. Graduation is the ultimate gift that you can provide educators as an appreciation. Graduation doesn't mean the end of opportunities at Tricy. Tri-C isn't just there to give you some classwork and send you on your way. It's a wonderful community that supports you and pushes you to pursue more opportunities, both while you're here and afterward. I really enjoyed my few years at Tri-C and it's kind of sad that I'm graduating. Corona what? Corona who? Guess what? We graduate in spring 2020. We made it through the rest of the semester. And what makes this even more special for me is that my great-grandmother graduated from Tri-C and also my grandmother. And now I'm the third generation. So in our family, Tri-C is really where futures began. And most of all, thanks to my family for their love and continued support during this journey. Thank you, it's been a blessing. Tri-C for me was kind of about coming, conquering, and earning, and I did all that. And I met some of the best educators that I've ever met in my whole entire life. They really helped me reach new goals. I am very thankful for the organizations that I'm in, such as Phi Theta Kappa, Mandel Scholars Program, the Honors Society, and Black American Student Council. 
without you guys, I don't know where I would be. So I just want to say thank you again. I just want to give a special thank you to the captioning and co-reporting faculty, to the program manager, Kelly Morans, and I just want to give a special thank you to Cuyahoga Community College for helping me reach this goal. Tracy became my home and my safe space. I never felt alone while attending my dear Western campus, and if I've ever felt lost or confused as of what to do next with my life, various counselors and advisors and offices were always there for me and to guide me into the right direction. I got to find the friends I really care about and to build my career with. I wouldn't be able to do that without Tri-C. I'll now be transferring to a four-year school to continue my studies, and Tri-C was a great way to get my foot in the door. I now feel prepared for anything. I would just like to say congratulations to my fellow classmates. This has been a challenging semester, but we did it. We graduated, so good job and congratulations. Thanks again, Tri-C. You changed my life. I hope that everyone is staying safe. I love you all and God bless. For those that did not think that I will fulfill my dreams, keep dreaming. Because Tri-C is the place where futures begin. And I'm just getting started on a bright future. Good evening. It was great to hear from so many graduates about what graduation means to them. I'm Dr. Andrew Pegman, Chairperson of the Joint Faculty Senate and Associate Professor of English. On behalf of the Tri-C faculty, I want to offer my sincere congratulations to all of our graduates. You persevered and succeeded in spite of some very difficult circumstances. You should be very proud of your accomplishments and know that we are very proud of you. As one of your professors, I'm extremely impressed that you were able to adapt to the change, and I know that the class of 2020 will be a great asset to the community. So now, let's hear some congratulatory messages from your professors. Congratulations, class of 2020. I wish you all the best. I know that there are so many great things you're gonna go out and conquer. And uh, I look forward to all that you're about to do in this world. So, congratulations. Your credential completion this spring is a testament to your commitment to success. You've demonstrated that in the face of adversity, you do not wear. In this unique time in our history, you stood the test and you earned your recognition. I just wanted to stop by to say congratulations to you on a job well done. I'm very proud of you. As you make your next steps in life, remember that every day presents opportunities. Make sure that you are always prepared to seize those moments when they arise. Work to make every day better than the last for you and the people around you. The grit, determination, and hard work that you have displayed as a student at Tri-C is admirable and inspiring. And as you endeavor to the next step in life in your journey, I wish you the very best. You've carried on and reached this graduation day. I'm so proud of you and I'm honored to be part of your success story. Wishing you continued success and good health. And remember, let's continue to work together even when we're apart. Together, apart, the Tri-C Class of 2020. Great job, guys. We're all so very proud of you. I wasn't an easy semester, but you guys did it. Be proud, be loud. You guys have earned all of it. You worked so hard to get here and your Tri-C family is so proud of you. Congratulations. Our future is in your hands and I could not be more proud to know that our Tri-C graduates are ready to take on any challenge. Continue to achieve your dreams and together we will make this world a better place. Today, we celebrate uh, a tremendous accomplishment on your part, and we just want you to know that we're very proud of you, and you should be very, very proud of yourselves. And so, I'd like to wish all of the graduates of 2020, wait a minute, I'm a cartoon. I don't need a face mask.
Let's do this. Congratulations to all the graduates, Spring 2020. You made it through classes during the 2020 COVID-19 pandemic. You even made it through all the Zoom and WebEx and remote meetings. Congratulations to our surgical technology graduates. Thank you for being such a phenomenal class. We appreciate all your hard work and dedication for the last two years, and woohoo, you did it. You have earned your degree at a monumental turning point in history. And although it's cliche to say that you're the future, you are honestly also the present. You are now, and I am so incredibly proud of you. Congratulations. Here am I, all dressed up and no place to go. No commencement to go to at least. But we're celebrating graduations just the same. And congratulations on your graduation. We know that this road may not have been easy, but for many of you, it is something that you desire to do and you've made it. We thank you for choosing Cuyahoga Community College. I personally thank you for allowing me to be a part of your journey. Please know that the community college staff and faculty are always here supporting you. We're behind you and we're always here for you. A phone call or even just a visit away. Congratulations again. We cannot wait to congratulate you in person, but for now have the happiest of happy graduation days and celebrate your accomplishments because you absolutely deserve it. A special shout out to the Health Information Management Technology students. I am so proud of you and I cannot wait to celebrate with you. I wanted to take a moment to say how proud I am of you all. It has been my honor to be one of your instructors on your educational journey. I know you're gonna do well. So congratulations again and make sure that you celebrate your special day. You deserve it. I know this is not how many of you wanted your journey to end, but just remember that commencement is actually the beginning. And so here's to many more years of success, and I'm really proud of all of you. We salute you, and we hope that you'll keep in touch with us in the next chapter of your life. Congratulations to all of you. Your ability to persevere through this difficult time speaks volumes to your dedication and your ability to achieve your goals. Best of luck in all you do. All of us here at Tracy, all the educators, are very proud of all of your achievements and our heads are flying in the air for you. It's been an honor to walk this journey with many of you. My life has certainly been richer for it and I look forward to our crossing paths again in one way or another many times in the future. So go forth with my best wishes and know that the future is bright indeed with you as part of it. And I wish you all hope, happiness, and above all, health. Congratulations to the class of 2020. Hello everyone. My name is Mohamed El Mansour Agal Mahmoud. I serve as board student scholar for the college. It is such a great honor to be in front of you today. Class of 2020, congratulations on becoming a Cuyahoga Community College graduate. Now, I would like to welcome you into the Tri-C family by reciting the alumni pledge. Please read along with me as the pledge appears on the screen. As a graduate, I know that Cuyahoga Community College will always be an important part of my life and I will not forget my responsibility to ensure the future of this great institution. I am now a proud graduate of Cuyahoga Community College. Congratulations again. Now I would like to introduce Dr. Karen Miller, Provost and Executive Vice President of Access Success Learning. Hi everyone. I'd also like to extend my most sincere congratulations to the class of 2020. There is nothing I would rather do than see each one of you walk across the stage, shake your hand, and congratulate you in person, but I am thrilled to be with you virtually. 
I know the last few months have been challenging to say the least. You've overcome adversity and all the things that life has thrown you and you have still persevered. You are now ready to move on to the next chapter of your life, even tougher and stronger than you were before. I wish you much health and happiness as you move to the next chapter of your lives. I'd also like to let you know that in celebration of your achievements, the Terminal Tower in downtown Cleveland will be lit up in Tri-C Teal all day tomorrow to celebrate your accomplishments. We're so excited for all of you. Now let's take a few minutes to view the names of all of our graduates. Congratulations, everyone.